The efficiency of perovskite solar cells have already reached commercial attractive values. So the next thing we really have to tackle is the stability of perovskite solar cells. And we see more and more people uh, measuring stability of perovskite solar cells, but they do it in completely different ways, which means that the data published is incomparable to each other. And that really hampers the entire endeavor. In order to address this problem, we build a unique setup to measure stability of perovskite solar cells under controlled environmental conditions. So we can control temperature, we can control light intensity, electrical load on a device, and the atmosphere. And by measuring more than 200 devices, we find some peculiarities of perovskite solar cells, which we think the community would benefit if they took them into account. The perovskite field is, uh, is very exciting. People see all these efficiency uh, increases and a climb from 3 to 22.3% or 7%. So all this has been uh, very exciting, but uh, one should not forget that at the end, you want to put a device out there in the rough environment, uh, the natural environment, and it has to last for 20, 25 years. This is not a general PV cell paper, but it, it uncovers some of the, uh, the specific feature of cloud solar cells.